Hey Bloodstrike fans, today we're going to bust the craziest myths in the game. Some of these myths sound wild, like, does the Nova Gas really kill Hank's turret? Or, does Knives Out copy a map from Bloodstrike? Well, today, we're about to find out the truth. Stay tuned because I'm busting all eight myths. Let's get started. Our first myth is a pretty sneaky one. Shadow Life says Bloodstrike has two different reload animations. One when you reload with ammo left, and another when you're completely out. So, I jumped into the training ground and picked up AP90. First, I reloaded with some ammo left in the mag and watched the reload animation closely. Then, I emptied the mag completely, reloaded again, and noticed something. Both animations look pretty similar, but at the end of the empty reload, there's this extra move where he pulls the charging handle back. I tried this with another weapon, and yep, the animation was different too. Turns out, this myth is confirmed. Yup, that's right. If you reload with some ammo left, the animation is different than when you're out completely. Nice detail, blood strike. Makes me feel like I'm in an action movie every time. Alright, here's one that's been on everyone's mind. Axis Edit says, can you actually jump into the bucket of an excavator in squad fight? I mean, this would be a crazy hiding spot if it works. So I hopped into squad fight mode, and yep, the only place you'll find the excavator bucket is on the Storm Peninsula map. So, I headed over, aimed for the bucket, and guess what? You can totally jump right in, no need to run around it or anything. You can just jump straight in, and guess what? Confirmed, you can actually jump in there. So, next time you want to confuse your enemies, maybe try chilling in the bucket. They'll never see it coming, Here's a myth that had me raising my eyebrows. Operator Control says in new game mode, if you pick up an enemy's gun, your ammo will drop to zero? That sounds brutal, right? Imagine picking up a new gun, only to have zero bullets. So, with the new big head mode out, I jumped right in to test this myth. After taking down an opponent, I picked up his gun, and nope, it didn't drop to zero ammo. I thought maybe switching back to my original gun would set the ammo to zero, like maybe that's what they meant, but I tried that too. Still had the same ammo I left it with. I even tested it a bunch of times just to be sure, but no luck. Whatever they were thinking, it just doesn't work. But guess what? Busted. It's not true. When you grab an enemy's gun, you still keep your ammo. That would have been a disaster otherwise. Now here's an interesting one. Spartan says can you inspect your gun if it has no ammo? Try it with car 98. So, I jumped into the training ground and grabbed my car 98. I emptied the mag, then tried to inspect the weapon, but it just started reloading automatically and wouldn't let me inspect it. I tested it a few more times, and yeah, the game just won't let you inspect with zero ammo. I even looked around in settings to see if I could turn off auto reload, but there's no option for that. So, turns out you can't inspect your weapon when you're out of ammo. Well, we tried it with the car 98 and busted. The second you try to inspect it, the gun starts reloading automatically. You can't stop it, no matter what you do. This next myth is about our favorite striker, Nova. Axis Edits says, did you know that Kala was the old name of Nova? I know it sounds like a wild rumor, but hey, let's test it out. Since I didn't play the beta version myself, I wasn't sure if it was true or not. So, I went digging around online. Instead of finding old videos, I stumbled on a screenshot on Google. There was a group of strikers and right there, Nova's old model was named Kala, which is actually the sniper's name now. But it's actually confirmed. Kala really was Nova's old name. Little bit of blood strike history for you. Okay, time for some map drama. Master Scale says is the map Isolated Island a copy of Bloodstrike? He didn't mention which map from Bloodstrike was copied, and he even got the map name wrong. So, I did some digging and found out the real name, Isolated Island. I went online to look for videos of this map from Knives Out, and right away, I could see it looks exactly like Bloodstrike's Deserted Valley. I'll give you guys a moment to check out the map yourselves. Take a good look and see if you spot the similarities. But here's the twist. The map wasn't copied from Bloodstrike. Since Knives Out came out first, it's actually Bloodstrike that copied it. And here's the funny part. Both games are owned by NetEase. Instead of making a brand new map, 
they just copy-pasted one from their other game. The myth is confirmed. Talk about saving time and resources, right? Now, here's a tactical myth. K7 Rider says, can Nova Gas destroy Hank's turret? Imagine if it could, it'd be such a cool trick. So, I jumped into a game with my friend from Discord. Feel free to join my server. The link is in the description. He picked Hank and set up his turret. I thought I'd hit it with Nova's gas, but guess what? It didn't take any damage. I tried again just to be sure, but nope, still nothing. What a bummer. Sadly, this myth is busted. The gas has absolutely no effect on Hank's turret. It just sits there like it's immune to the whole thing. So, if you're trying to take down a turret, Nova Gas isn't your answer. And now for the final myth of the day. Fond Heat Edits says, does Volt's ability get rid of Nova Gas? This would be super useful, especially in tight situations. So, my friend and I jumped back into the game. This time, he picked Nova and tossed out the gas. I tried using Volta's ability to disperse it, but it didn't work. I thought maybe I didn't charge the ability enough, so I gave it another shot. This time, I fully loaded it, but I still ended up taking damage from Nova's gas. Unfortunately busted. Volt's ability does nothing to the gas. It just floats around as if nothing happened. Sorry, Volt fans. No superhero moment for you here. And that's it, guys. Eight crazy myths in Bloodstrike. Some were true, some were just legends, but hey, that's what makes the game exciting. Which myths surprise you the most? Let me know in the comments and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon for more myth-busting action. Until next time, peace out.